twice. This was certainly uncalled for. Activist leader Reverend Al Sharpton is fired up today. The course of any week, we have an allegation. This week, the allegation is possible financial fraud. The FBI and IRS are believed to be going after Sharpton and his organization for tax fraud and campaign violations from his 2004 presidential bid. Federal authorities subpoenaed around 10 of Sharpton's associates Wednesday to testify before a federal grand jury and turn over financial records dating as far back as 2001. And it is outlandish to think that we have any financial documents in this case. I have probably been under every investigation known to man, and I can't remember a time that I've not been under investigation. Sharpton says it's all a sham, a retaliatory effort on part of the Justice Department coming just weeks after he led a massive march in light of the Gina 6 trial in Louisiana. It is no small matter that just three weeks ago, tens of thousands of people, I helped to organize the march on the Justice Department that now conveniently leaks uh, their swooping down on aides and friends and associates of mine. Federal officials will not comment on the charges brought against Sharpton, but this is not the first time Sharpton was singled out by federal officials. In 1993, he pleaded guilty to neglecting to file state income tax returns. In 2005, he agreed to repay the government $100,000 after violating campaign funding regulations. I personally, out of my pocket, paid back. Sharpton says he plans on cooperating with federal officials and that this incident hasn't put a damper on his plans. The controversial activist plans to hit the campaign trail with an endorsement for a presidential candidate in the weeks to come. Bonnie Ghosh, The Associated Press, New York.